Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the world of Risk Global Domination. I am Kilted. I'm a competitive player in Risk Online, and today we are going to be doing a competition. We're going to be playing the 70% tournament, and uh, we're going to be entering round one. The way this tournament works is you play one game per round. Uh, it's 70% progressive domination game. Progressive 70% domination game. Need to capture only 70% of the board uh, with progressive cards. First map we're going to be playing is Greece. I will go over the settings when we get into the game. But uh, progressive 70, the entire tournament is a 70% tournament. Uh, a lot of the best players in the world are entered. We've got some great opponents. Zero Keys, an absolutely excellent player. He was rank one for like three years straight. <laughs> Game Solo T, who uh, I, I played him one time in a video and I called him Game Solo, or I called him Game Solo T. And now it, other people have also called him Game Solo T. And now it's kind of stuck, but it's Games a lot. We've got Finnish Joke as well, another Grandmaster. We just like excellent players all around. Uh, Driz as well, Grandmaster. And uh, community support staff, call me, I thought that was nerd, but whatever, call him a nerd. And uh, we're going to have another player joining, and they're also going to be a Grandmaster, most likely. So it's a very high skill lobby, progressive 70% domination game, uh, round one of this tournament. I've never tried the 70% tournament before, but uh, the first time it went by, a lot of people liked it, so I tried to join it this game. Uh, let's just, let's hop into the game. Okay, here we go. We are hopping into the game. Greece, progressive, 70% domination. 90 second turn timer. So I'm going to have a lot of time. If I am if I get a chance to run the 70, I will have all the time in the world and no excuses for not making it. I mean, the only excuse would be dice don't work for me. But if I pass wrong, that would be on me. What a weird situation here. Do I, where's my bonus? I don't see a, a juicy bonus. I get a lot of troops in the first turn. Gonna send alliances out to everybody. So we're gonna be playing Fog and Alliances. I'm in the... Oh. Well, I screwed up and misclicked a spot on uh, the stream. So, uh, or on OBS. So look at my forehead. I'm just gonna cut that mini second out there. <laughs> you won't see it, but on my screen, I clicked and went to like the wrong tab in OBS and it was just my forehead zoomed in. I'm like, <laughs> ridiculous. Uh so I'm not going to get this bonus. So um, first off, it's Greece. 90 second turn timers. A lot of time to run the progressive 70% domination. We have expert AI. Alliances and fog on and blizzards on. So blizzards make the, the board pretty choky. So North Aegean or whatever is cut off here. And so is uh, Crete on the bottom. Now I do apologize that these are harder to see territories. Uh, if you're watching the video on mobile, I have to have them kind of small so they're easier to click later when it's time to run. Now I'm the black player, I go last, so I should get six troops on the first turn at the very minimum to uh, to give me a chance. So uh, Pink's just gonna, look at this god spawn for Pink. Like, imagine you just like, look at this, just West Macedonia, solid plus three. Now I will, what, go for Dota Kines maybe? Go for this too, but somebody else might go for it. Green, no, Green's not going for it. Cause I can't, this bonus is up here, I can't get it. Uh, wait, I could go for East Macedonia and Thrace, maybe? Come across the top. Boom, 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 boom. That's a lock-in. Actually, that's a solid. That's a solid plus four I can get and lock this corner down. Lock it down from a one point and Sarah's. That's actually not bad. A solid plus four in the first turn. And then I leave this stack here to maybe do a whoop -dee down here. I do want a second bonus if I can get it. <clears throat> that is a good first bonus for me and nobody's going to contest it, so... Six troops means I can make a 10 here, go nine, eight, seven, six, maybe five, bring the two on it, and I can have a six stack here, single point guard on my, uh, whatever this is, on my plus four, right? Single point guard on my plus four from the first turn. That is not a bad start. I'll take it. Who else is getting a bonus? So obviously pink gets his plus three on the first turn, and uh, so does blue. Does white get a bonus on the first turn? Um, maybe they go nine on three on two. Maybe they go for like Western Greece. Sorry, I'm, I'm going to turn the UI down just so you guys can see the bonuses a little better. All right, so you've got uh, the four here, the six. West Macedonia is a three. This Epirus right here, nobody finished it. I guess he let red move out, but that little bonus is a plus three. The islands here are a plus three, four here. Attica is a three, but you got to remember you need this little island down here to get Attica. And then uh, the, the two over here. And if you guys keep wondering why I'm not going for over here, it would be because of this. Although if I get my plus four here, maybe I can come out and take this and I can go two plus fours this game. 
<clears throat> that wouldn't be a terrible idea. I'd have to do quite a bit of a reach around here to get in, though. White's actually not taking a bonus. Oh, wait. He's... Oh, he does. He takes Aegean. Okay, there it is. With a six on three. Okay, so I take my plus four right away. If I start getting that plus four immediately and I get the first trade and it's a big one, that would be uh, ideal. I'm going to, sorry, I'll, I will up the UI back to like around 50. We're going to do sliders because every troop matters. I'm going to do the best I can in this tournament. Now, I didn't play in the original 70% tournament, the first one. But uh, I heard good things. Everybody thoroughly enjoyed it. It basically played similar, sort of similar to the Grandmaster tournament in the same server. So I did lose one troop there. I'm make that a five. So I've got my bonus. I'm on 22 troops. Green's on 20 at the, at the end of his second turn. He's trying to take both these bonuses, but I might just clean him out of the bottom here. I might just clean him out and take this plus two, or blue might. I don't know. I do want a second bonus, and I think it's not a bad idea. Yeah, attack something. Okay. I'm going to clean that out, so you're not... He's pretty much holding this two for me, so I appreciate that. Uh, green is the new guy that joined up. Uh, 42,000 rank points Grandmaster. So the person we didn't check their stats at the start uh, was later arriving. Uh, they didn't make it, so we had to fill in somebody covers. And that's, oh, he needs to win this. He's asking me to leave with that. <clears throat> Red still doesn't have a single bonus. That's Driz. So I have allied with everybody. I thought I sent allies to everybody, but maybe people thumbs down on Broke Alliance when I wasn't paying attention. Pink immediately breaks white here. He immediately breaks white. Maybe he wants that bonus, or... I don't hate that. I'm gonna get very strong. So, blue's zero key, right? Probably... If we're gonna go through the opponent's names, uh, zero key's probably the most decorated of my opponents. And... Uh, if I do take this plus two, I either he's gonna be friendly with me... Or he's going to turn on me. Right? He might feel like I'm too big of a threat if I take that. Right? So I I have to decide. I have to play appropriately here. Right? Depending on my opponents. He's on 28 troops. He's probably going to buff his threes. If I take this, he might think it's too much. And he might get scared. And if he does that, then what's my scenario going to look like? I don't want to beef with him. If he takes the second bonus here... I don't blame him, and then if he does, I'm going to take a second, and we're going to be cool. I'm just going to say well played. Okay. So this is a 60... What was it? I think I believe it's like a 64 territory map, and then it's got six blizzards or something, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. So it's like a, it's a 58 territory map, and you need to capture 70%. So that, it plays way different than a World Dom game where you have to actually eliminate everybody. You actually can win without eliminating anybody. You just need to capture 70% of the board, which in this case, which I have done the math, is 41 territories. So if you capture 41 territories, you will own the uh, the 70%. You will win. <clears throat> so um, he wants to hit my territory. Okay, I'll give I'll give him a thumbs up. And uh, I'm going to tell Green that I'm sorry, I need to hit your territory. Make this a 9. Make this a 7. I guard my plus 4 up there. I'm going to start working on this plus 2. I'm not going to give it to Green. I'm watching for Zero Key to be signaling good game or something like that. And uh, thumbs up and a fist bump. And bring a three. I'll bring one of the troops back. I I, I want to even less on the border. He can hit me here, but I can come back, right? <clears throat> and if he gets knocked out of either of these sides, he's screwed. So that's why I didn't want to leave a three here. I left less. Now, green may be mad at me and try to break, but going through the blue three into my two is difficult when... Oh, he's got six troops, actually. He could have done it. Now he's going to do something else. Yeah, he's going to just take a card here. Chill with his bonus. Yeah, he wanted a second bonus, but uh, too slow. He's looking at trying to get this as a second bonus now. So if I 
cleaned this whole pocket. It would be a two-point guard here or a two-point guard. I could two-point guard this. The bot like this bo this map with these blizzards makes things very awkward. Oh, oh, oops. Yeah, give him a, th a thumbs up and a heart. And an oops, <clears throat> a thumbs up, a heart. Oops, I meant to roll that. I, I I literally Driz, if you watch this later, I seriously meant to roll that. I'm sorry. I I'm sorry. <laughs> He might think I'm playing him like, oops, I forgot. And I've done that before. But I actually intended to, to uh, roll that for him there. So it is what it is. <clears throat> He's not got a plus five. Pink's now on uh, a three and a three. I'm on a four and a two. Pink's on a three and a three. Uh, blue's on a three and a three. Yeah, so my four and two is not too overpowered. Everybody else is basically on a plus six. And red, I think, just took a plus five, right? Thessaly is a plus five. Greece is... Uh, Quite the interesting map for bonuses. White has no bonuses. And 10 troops. He's basically dead. Ah. Okay. He doesn't like me there. Okay. He actually knocked me out of here, so I can't even do the reach around. <clears throat> That's cool. Need him to hit blue, because I'm coming. I'm coming through his four. <clears throat> Come on. Let's do it. No. Attack blue. <laughs> okay, take the bonus, but I might come through your four stack. <clears throat> okay. Make this a uh, eight. Make this a ten. <laughs> okay. I'm asking everybody to hit blue now. So there it is. That's what I was saying. If I take this bonus, he might turn on me. And if he turns on me, then I'm, I'm going to make sure he loses the game, right? <clears throat> ah, he's going to take this bonus. Blue will backstab you, bro. Oh, yeah, yeah, Thank you. That actually knocks blue out of here from retaliating on me. He's going to take this bonus now. Nice. Blue would have to come off this, too. He does get double bonus, so he gets eight troops. He could make a ten. Nine, come through the three. The Like, he can get in here. Green's trying to signal he wants to come through. That doesn't make sense. Stay there. Stay there with your three. No. Why'd you do that? Can I ask red to hit blue? Like, obviously, blue's going to take this next, right? He's trying to play the uh, the uh, the blizzard bonus, right? Oh, he's going to knock the two out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well played. Now I'm going to ask Pink to hit blue. Everybody's hitting blue now. Maybe you shouldn't have fucked around. <laughs> oh my god, everybody's like, let's do it. Yeah, don't take three bonuses, dog. You didn't fuck around, you find out. Now what's up? Now he's going to hit people. Go for it. Uh, if he doesn't get through this four and break me, I get to hold two bonuses again. I, I, ha I have a chance to be back in the game. <clears throat> Is he going to come? He might actually come through these ones. He wants to get back at everybody, but like everybody, literally everybody hit him. It's knocking red out. Fine, he doesn't get this bonus. Yeah, he's down to 20 troops. I could have went through the white four, but I went through pink and a pot. Like, pink didn't get it, hold a grudge on me for that, though, so that's good. Dude, he could hit this three. Really cripple his game. 
All right. <clears throat> okay, I'll set him out. <clears throat> I'm only on 15 troops. I took a lot of damage there, right? But uh, I full sent on him, and now his game's in trouble, right? Only winning matters, so uh, playing for eliminations doesn't matter in this, right? You need to win the game, and if you lose the game, at least you need to stay alive. If you lose the game but you stay alive, you get like two points. I guess that helps a little bit. And uh, I'm hoping he doesn't break me here. I mean, I just full sent on blue, so I'm assuming not. Yeah, he's not. Pink was the one that broke him originally. He may break pink. Maybe not. Now I have a four and a three, by the way. So I probably buff this one. Maybe I don't have to. I can buff this one. 11, that's a good group of troops. Now, where do I want my card? I need to take a card out here. So I'll go one, two, three. This a three. This a three and make this a... I don't want to lose my position down here. Do this. Okay. Send pink a heart. I'm kind of, uh, in case blue does try to go through people and do stuff. Would he knock blue out of here? Attack blue. Thumbs up. It can't... Oh, dude, if he knocks blue out of here, he's fucking toast. He's trapped behind green and white. And he has to hit green or white. And green and white won't hit him, and that's fine, but he'll hit you. I can try. I can try. Tag blue. Heart. Uh, dude, I, it's all fun, right? Like, alliances are cool. Um, I know why he hit me, and I don't even think it was incorrect. I don't think it... Oh my god, he's doing it. <laughs> Syracuse pissed. Dude, he's pissed. He's so pissed. Watch this. I'll send him a heart. He's so pissed, man. <laughs> oh, I love him. He's gonna trade and suicide me, but uh, how does he get me? He'd have to go. Like he can break this, but he can take this and screw me here, right? And but Pink's gonna knock him out of here. Yeah, he knocks him out. Uh, now if he wants to, he can trade and come through this six. Yeah, he's going to. He's pissed. <clears throat> He's coming. He's gonna hit me. He's gonna hit this three, but he's gonna go through white six. So white's gonna get punished for not knocking him out of here. Oh no, maybe not. He just retakes. No, he's card skipping in the corner. Good luck. Yeah, yeah. Woo! Uh, like, cause I understand why he hit me, right? If I have this section and he's literally got like a lone little stack in Lasithi. If I ever hit Lasithi, he can never get back to taking this bottom bonus, right? Because of the blizzards. He can't get all the way around. And if I take that from him, he's screwed, right? So I can see why he would... He's scared that I was going to knock him out. I wasn't planning on it because I didn't want to play a bad neighbor game. But in his head, he was probably concerned. So <clears throat> it is what it is. Uh, I'm not going to early trade. Now I'm going to take a card here. Make this... Uh, an eight. Make this a ten. I'm gonna kind of guard these islands a bit better. And we'll do this. Now I've got two tens, kind of guarding my bonuses. I'm on 36 troops, which is like I, I'm in the best position troop-wise, and I get the biggest trade. So like I'm technically still winning the game right now in my current position. That can change immediately, but I, I've. Uh, I took that hit, and I'm still in first place troop-wise. Now, because it's progressive, though, I probably lose. Um, second set of trades, right? If you guys know how progressive work, the second set of trades are going to be uh, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. So if, if I should get, like, the 45 trade, but somebody that gets, like, the 30 is going to trade on with the 30, kill the next person, which is probably white. Like, he's going to be vulnerable. And then take his cards, get 35 additional troops. So it's like red or pink can trade, 
run a bunch of the board and kill white, trade again, run a bunch of the board and get the 70. And they will have the full 90 second timer. Plus if you get an elimination, you get 30 seconds more. So they'll have a full two minutes to literally calculate how to get 41 territories. Right, it's 41 I said? Yeah, 41. Like that's, it's it's very easy, especially at a higher skill level to to get the 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 70 in this scenario. So like maybe I have to pray and get a set on, like I'm gonna trade my triple artillery and then I pray that I get an artillery. Maybe I'll have to trade on three and just try to run. <clears throat> maybe there's a path I can get to 41, I don't know. Maybe I take this bonus? No, I'm definitely not taking this bonus. Um, but like this 10 comes through the four into the one. These ones are free. This one can come down like this. This 10 comes through, ones are free. I'd have to go through the 11 to get through these ones. But these ones go through here. Now this 16 and the 11 do block some territories here, which are awkward. And I also keep in mind, I've got to get 41 out of 58. So there's 17 territories. I have to get everything except for 17, not counting the blizzards. Uh, he's going to hit green. Yeah. That makes sense. Green tried to take an extra big bonus, and uh, he's like, no. A central Greece. I could go for Central Macedonia, but it's not going to happen. Zero Key's not wasting time, though. At least he starts skipping quickly. Now his goal is, okay, I've lost the game. I need to not die. Because if you die, you uh, get zero points at the end of the game. As long as you survive, you will get uh, two points for, being in to, for surviving, right? Like, if... Most of us are going to be alive when the game's over. And everybody that doesn't win will get two points. So if he's alive, he gets the same as everybody else, even though he's in a really bad position right now. So what he's doing right now is very smart. So triple artillery, so I have more chance of getting an artillery again, which would give me a trade on three. Um, it's just uh, one, two, three, this one. This 24 is in my face. I don't like that. Pink's getting ready to run or what? There's 25 here that blocks off these bonuses or these cards all behind here, right? Make it harder on them. I'm hoping pink doesn't trade on three and run it. That 24 pointed at me I don't like, so I'm going to go here. Gives me two pathways with it. Uh, I didn't get a trade on three, so I'm in a lot of trouble. Probably don't win. <clears throat> I back off his big stack. He wants access to the board with it. <clears throat> so, like, I... If you're looking at how to line up a 70% run, you can see my position, right? This three on one takes this territory. This five goes bop, bop, bop. The 23 comes out, pops into here, and comes down, right? Like, I am lined up, and the 20 here can come through, pop all of this, right? Maybe hits the 20 a bit, so my other stack comes through the 20, and then I can come through, right? And if I get that much of the board, I probably win. Now the question is, do I have enough troops to make all that work? Yeah, Green's going to be trading on three. Uh, 69 will dab. Don't run it. He's not running it, right? Okay, he trades on three, doesn't run it. This is a little dangerous. Now... <laughs> If somebody trades on three and like fail kills somebody, can I get a kill? This 23 can come through the four. Like white has 38 troops, right? That's all of white. If I can kill white this turn, I could change that into a win. And I did put my 20 here. That kills the 14. So I need this stack to be able to go through this four and kill white. If I kill white, I win. And I'm just seeing that now. So maybe I should have been a little bit better. For Let's see, white's gonna start with, by the way, uh, six troops on his turn, so he'll be at 44. But if I'm getting how many? 11, I can make this a 34 and come through. That should be enough to go one, one, four, one, one, 22, two. It should be enough. Do another down. I hope he doesn't run. Although if he runs, actually if he runs, as long as he doesn't hit my two stacks, I might be able to, I have to get 40, one territories in total and i only have a 20 stack and a 23 so technically i like it'll be hard for me to get to the 41 if he runs and even if he opens the board i just don't have enough troops i need to kill white if white has no trade on three i think i can win i think i win <clears throat> he's not running it i don't think yeah he's doing a four on one okay 
I think I win. That three is annoying. I have to add a couple troops here after the trade just to make sure I get in. Yeah, he's going to skip. White doesn't trade. Please don't trade. Everybody trade on. If he doesn't trade, I win, I think. Please don't trade. Heart is beaten. I'm ready to roll. And Red's going to run it. If, if he trades, I can't kill him, and then Red runs. He's deploying. He's hovering, deploying. Uh, attack green. Thumbs up or thumbs down. I'm gonna. I'm trying to confuse him, right? Attack green, thumbs up, thumbs down. Like, what are we doing? You don't know. Like, should we hit green? Like, what's going to happen? I'm trying to. I'm trying to give him more things to think about <clears throat> than uh, the fact that I'm about to win the game if he doesn't trade. Please don't trade. Good. Good luck. Can I get it? Yes. Got him. Okay. <laughs> That's a big trade. Can I kill red? I don't think I can kill red. I just got a I have time. Um Red has, what, 45 troops? I only got 30. So let's go one here. Make this a nine. Make this uh the seven hits this. Make this a, I don't know, a nine. Make this like the six, seven. It's actually like a 16 to come through the fours. And then like this, right? Two. Bounty and win. Let's go. Ooh, we're in it. We're in it. Round one, baby. We got one bounty and a win. Great game. Whoo! I saw that at the right moment. That white was very easy to kill, and I had my troops lined on him. Fortunately, uh, great game. Uh, and we also got to punish Zero Key for slapping me in the butt. <laughs> Uh, I can't believe everybody went along with hitting him after that. I, I know he's frustrated. Sorry about that. Um, great game. Six Grandmasters uh, in a great bunch of opponents. First round of the 70% tournament. We take it down. I'll be bringing you round two later, uh, well, next week, I guess. Uh, excited to see how this tournament goes. Um, thank you guys for hanging into the end of the video. Please subscribe if you want to. This is my second channel. So I'll have some odd tournament games here, some stream games, and then I'll start recording extra games to post here in the future as well, maybe when I cut back on streaming. So uh, if you love Risk and you love my content, definitely subscribe to this channel if you haven't already, and I will catch you guys in the next one.